Today, I'm tuning my studio monitors and correcting the sound of my home studio using the new Audient Aurea Mini. This is a brand new piece of gear that takes room correction and convenience to the next level. It combines the power of Sonarworks Sound ID reference software with the portability of a small desktop USB-C device. And today, I'm walking you through all the features, setup steps, and software that you get with the Audient Aurea Mini. Plus, at the end, I'm revealing the finished results of my home studio before and after room correction. But first, let's take a closer look at the Aurea Mini and check out the design, inputs, outputs, and controls. This device features high quality 32-bit converters for the purest sound quality possible, plus an impressive 127 dB of dynamic range to mix and master your music. And Aurea Mini features onboard DSP chips that power the built-in EQs to correct your speakers, crossover networks to control your sub, trim, levels, and speaker delay settings. These DSP chips don't power your mixing and mastering plugins or take CPU away from your DAW. It's DSP specifically for the functions within the Aurea Mini. But that's enough about the inside. Let's take a look at the outside. The first thing you notice when you unbox the device is how compact and lightweight they've made it. You no longer need a big chunky piece of gear in a rack that costs thousands of dollars to get professional results in any space. On the front, you have four lights that indicate which of the four presets you have open and the button on the front to switch between your presets by hand. Having four assignable slots means you can save your main room correction EQ to one, your uncorrected profile to two, maybe a mix cube emulation to three, and some NS10s, car test, or cell phone emulation to slot four. The possibilities really are endless. But flipping over to the back is where all the magic happens. We have all of our inputs and outputs. From left to right, we have our USB-C connection, which powers the whole device and interfaces with the app, plus quarter inch outputs for your left monitor, right monitor, and an independent subwoofer output. I actually like connecting my sub this way rather than connecting my two speakers to the sub. The next input we get is optical spdif, which is my personal favorite way to connect the Aurea Mini to any audio interface. Digital optical spit of connection means you skip the converters in your audio interface and send perfect quality audio between the two devices. But if you like to use quarter inch connection with analog cables, you can combine the converters from your interface with the converters in the Aurea Mini. You'll notice that there's no mic input for the included sound ID measurement mic. And that's because it connects directly to your audio interface, not the Aurea Mini directly. So whatever audio interface you have, you'll be able to plug this mic straight in and get great room correction results. The rest of the features are found in the Aurea Control app. This is where you set up and control everything regarding your studio monitor's volume, input source, profiles, subwoofer crossover settings, metering, and more. We're going to be coming back to this app later after we measure our monitors and room using the Sound ID Reference app. So let's go through the initial setups in Sonarworks Sound ID and begin measuring our room. First, you connect your measurement mic to any input on your audio interface and make sure all the levels are balanced before beginning the real room measurement process. You just connect your microphone, set the input gain, and make sure all your levels are balanced for a perfect measurement process. Once you get started, you spend about 20 minutes moving the mic around to various points in your room, and a series of sine wave sweeps and laser noises play through your monitors, and it sounds like this. And then after hitting about 30 different measurement points around the room, we finally have our correction profile custom EQ curve. This perfectly offsets all the peaks and dips in my home studio's frequency response, giving me a completely flat sound that's perfect for producing, mixing, and mastering. You also get a massive menu of different studio monitor emulations, headphones, car tests, and customer electronics for a wide variety of ways to check your work. Once you're ready to go, you can export your personal room correction profile straight to the Aurea Mini and assign it as preset one in your device. In addition to using the curves from Sonarworks, you can also create your own curves in the Aurea Control app, where you can dial in your own custom EQ presets and manually tweak your speaker settings by hand if you want. This is a cool way to check your low end by filtering away all the highs or create your own mix cube effect by ear. And just like that, you're ready to start producing, mixing, or mastering with Aurea Mini. So let's pull up an Ableton session for a cover care produce of a song called Move Your Body, and we'll take a listen through the Neumann TLM microphone, capturing the sound in my room for us to hear the difference. First, let's hear the room before correction. And after correction. Go, go, go. Ooh. 
An Oreo Mini. The difference I heard was subtle, but definitely noticeably better with the Aurea Mini room correction enabled. It felt smoother, less enhanced, but that's exactly what you want when it comes to neutralizing and flattening the sound of your monitors. Overall, I think the Audient Aurea Mini is really a useful addition to anyone who is already correcting the room with Sonarworks or someone who is curious about room correction and to see if it's useful in your studio. I'd recommend this to anyone with a small or large home studio that would benefit from hearing their music from a truly flat perspective. And for the price of just $449, this device makes it more affordable and accessible than ever to not only correct your room, but expand your speaker system's functionality and sonic possibilities. Plus, if you already own a license for Sonarworks Sound ID Reference, you can purchase Aurea Mini with the measurement mic for just $299. So if you want to learn more about the Audient Aurea Mini, I'll include links in the description below and catch you guys next time in another video.